let me see here um all right this one is on a uh, live station uh here, here's the client and basically is it you know a client to watch uh streaming videos um they do have a few channels uh, they don't have a lot in my opinion although it looks like you have a lot but it really is not that m many that is uh, good now the only thing I recommend in here is uh, if you're gonna watch uh, either news or uh, music videos okay because that's really what I think that this is uh, good at right now uh, anything else like movies and stuff like that they, they do have some movie channels but the movies are really old and not that interesting and they have some TV shows too, but like I said, old and not interesting. Uh, so, this is what the client looks like. The quality is great, okay? Um, for streaming video, that is. Um, not on, you know, super high quality, but it's decent. And you can go full screen if you like, like this, okay? And they do have some other uh, way to navigate, like this uh, thing here, like uh, Eliza Medicine used to have it. And you can, you know, surf your channel here if you like. Uh, so that's one interface. Okay, but uh, not really that important right now. Now, as far as this right here, they have um, different stuff. Like, you can chat uh, if you like. Uh, no one really chats, really, but uh, you could. Alerts, not really important. And what's hot is, um, you know, all the channels are here. Uh, you'll see how many people are viewing that like most people are watching the news here okay and some people are watching uh, the music channel so which uh that's how you know which channel is uh, you know, big so that's that's cool to indicate uh, which one is uh you know a lot of people are viewing uh, as far as the search now if you search for news or maybe cartoon or movies or something you have a different list okay and in here you can just uh uh, the one that has the pictures, I, I I believe, is the only one that has video on it, and the one with like the uh, the black logo, uh, means that it's like audio only. I believe, uh, not always, but uh, usually that's how it is. And if you want to add the channel, just uh, click on Add, and they have a rating. Uh, I think this rating is based on how slow the channel is, or or how great the channel is, but uh, usually um, the lower this is the slow. Uh, way to connect to it and in here they have this button right here where it says uh, the most added so th you click on that you have uh, all the channels that uh, you know a lot of people have added to their uh, my channel list here so after you add it uh, all your um, you know your channels will be listed here and to switch channels is pretty much easy you know you click on a different uh, channel and you'll be connected to it so if I click on this you see, I'll say uh, connecting, and it's gonna load in some. Um, it's gonna load in a new stream, and there you go. You have uh, a new 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 channel to watch, and that's pretty much it. That's all I really want to say. Uh, uh, the first time you install this, you're gonna have to make an account, uh, which is free. So let me sign out here. Okay, and uh, create account. It looks something like this. Just type in your email, you know, your password and all that. And um, it'll say create account. That's pretty much it. You want to ma make one. But uh, to install this, uh, go ahead and go to their site. Here, click on this Penguin if you're Linux. Uh, there's a Mac and there's a Windows version. So you're in luck. Oh, you know, all the operating system right there. Uh, just download it. And for this part here, where it says type, whatever, just skip that part and, and uh, follow what I do uh, right now. Okay. I just basically go in here and go down to properties and go to permission. Allow executing. Uh, check that. And that's pretty much it. And now I can just double click on it and hit the run. <laughs> and you have this uh, window right and just continue following what they said here what did they say uh, press Q and Y you know uh, basic stuff so let me um, let's see press Q Y to accept and then just keep following the, the things push enter 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 
for the default uh, directory and at the end they'll tell you to uh, type in your password and uh, you finish with the installation now they won't give you any icons so the thing you gotta do is uh, make an icon yourself in your uh, menus here right? and so uh, what we're gonna do is uh, you know make a uh, live station icon and then it just put in live station and that's pretty much it okay? tap in this for the command and that's how you have your own uh, startup logo so that's how you make a launcher now when you first install this um, I don't I don't know if you, if you have no sound uh, you you need to follow what I'm doing right now uh, let me see where is it at so make sure it says um, make sure this is not hidden okay and uh, if you don't have this uh, file just uh, make a new one you know create a document and name it exactly like this open uh, ALRC make sure the dot is there and inside it <coughs> you're gonna type in uh, this okay uh, define devices uh, also native and uh, the other one is also you know blah 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 just copy that now if you're using some other one like um, some people use this um, what is that OSS or something just uh, replace all the the also with OSS or I think some people use eSound so ESD also so try that if you have some other one but I'm using uh, also so um, that's pretty much it for the sound and I uh, just save it and uh, start up your uh, live station again and it will have sound okay so that is pretty much it um, it's an experimental version but it works um, it's smooth so that is it